Hey guys, welcome back to another video and if you're new here, my name is Edward Smith and welcome to my YouTube channel and today we're going to be looking at two quality microphones from Warm Audio, the WA47 Junior and the WA47 Tube Condenser. Both of these microphones are based on a recreation of the legendary K47 mic capsule found in the vintage U47 but other than that, these microphones have quite a few differences. So before we get into these microphones, I would first like to thank Joss from Sweetwater for sending me these products and for sponsoring today's video. As you guys know, I purchase all my microphones and all my studio gear from Sweetwater because they have the best variety and best customer service and there's just no better place to go. So if you end up being interested in these microphones or any other studio gear, I will leave some Sweetwater links down in the description below. And then lastly, make sure you stick around all the way till the end of this video so you don't miss the singing test comparison between these two microphones as that's usually the part that helps most of you pick the right microphone for your setup. But enough talking from me, let's have a look at these microphones and see what they're all about. Starting off with the Warm Audio WA47 Junior, this microphone will cost you a total of $300. In the box you get a silver shock mount and basic stand connector and a leather pouch to store the microphone when not in use. Lastly, you get the microphone itself, which looks super clean in the nickel colored design. The WA47 Junior also offers a roll-off and attenuation feature, including great versatility with an omnidirectional card weight and bidirectional polar pattern option. In terms of frequency response, the WA47 Junior is nice and flat, with only a few bumps on the high end. Note, this microphone does need 48 volts of phantom power to work, so if you don't have an audio interface, links will be in the description. Moving on to the Warm Audio WA47, this microphone will cost you a total of $1,000. Since this microphone is an all vacuum tube condenser, it comes with its very own power supply unit, including the power cable and 7-pin microphone cable. You also get a silver shock mount, beautiful wooden case, and lastly, the microphone itself, which looks absolutely stunning. Unlike the WA47 Junior, this microphone offers nine different polar pickups based on an omnidirectional cardoid and bidirectional layout. This gives you a lot of versatility for any recording need you might have. One thing I personally like about the design of this microphone is having the polar pattern options on the power supply instead of the microphone itself. This keeps the microphone looking clean and also ensures I don't leave any ugly fingerprints on the body. In terms of frequency response, the WA47 is flat, with no cutoff on the low end or extensive enhancements on the highs, giving you a natural sounding vocal every time. Now, when comparing the WA47 Junior with the WA47, the first clear difference between these two microphones is their difference in size. But as a matter of fact, the biggest difference between these microphones is actually their circuits. The smaller 47 Junior has a FET circuit and the WA47 has a tube circuit. This results in both microphones sounding totally different, but the question you're probably asking is whether or not that difference is worth $700. Let's find out. Settle down with me, cuddle me up, and cuddle me in. Lie down with me and, and hold me in your arms With your heart against my chest, your lips pressed to my neck I'm falling for your eyes, but they don't know me yet And this feeling I'm forgetting, is that I'm in love now Kiss me like you want to be loved Like you want to be loved Want to be loved This feels like falling in love I'm falling in love I'm falling in love 
Now, for the final take, when it comes to the Warm Audio WA47, I think for $300, this microphone definitely offers a lot. The fact that you're getting a shock mount, you're getting a nice bag, you're getting a quality microphone with three different polar patterns, a little bit of versatility, and a really good sounding microphone at the end of the day. This microphone is really a great starter microphone for those of you looking for a product that's gonna give you everything you need, especially if you're starting out. On the other hand, with the WA47, the versatility that this microphone offers with nine different polar patterns is absolutely fantastic. The fact that it is a tube condenser means you have a little bit more warmth, your vocal is picked up a little bit more naturally, you don't have any cutoff on the low end or any bump up on the highs. So for vocal recording and just a microphone that can do everything with the crazy versatility it offers, this is that once in a lifetime type microphone that you won't want to upgrade anytime soon and that will definitely do an outstanding job every single time. So that brings this video to an end of my microphone comparison between the Warm Audio WA47 Junior and the WA47. And just a reminder, if you're interested in any of these microphones, the links will be down in the description below. If you have any questions about today's video, just leave a comment down below and I'll try and get back to you as soon as I can. But other than that, thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, please do give it a thumbs up. And if you loved it, subscribe down below. And I will see you for another video next time.